going to give you some thinking time. Is allowed. Mm. From you. Yeah. Okay. All right. Would you like a fast fight? Fast fight. Okay, I'll make one of the jeep ones. Let's pull it out. I'm gonna decorate the fish once I make it. Okay, I'm just gonna make a fish here. So we're gonna make a paper plane. There's gonna be a little hole in the paper plane. We're gonna decorate the plane and the fish plane. Fold it. Okay, we're gonna make the fish like so it can, you can blow on it. Nice. Go to use your ruler. You've got to the tail. See? No, you have to do this. Okay, we're gonna do the logo one. The kids are going to make a decision and make a decision and make a decision and make a decision. 과연 어떤 모양의 물고기들이 완성될까요? that you will race okay and you're going to decide how far this fish is going to be raced so for the full length of the block from one end to the other hands up door to doors okay the majority speak if we touch it with a piece of paper should it be like a five second time signal you can see wait what do you think three second for accidental five seconds hands up if you think what what if the roof decides to be unfair like it's in prison that I like, hate and like, it will be like the audience decision on that. You brought up a really, really good point. You as spectators and as the one, I'm thinking of one that begins with like, integrity. 아이들이 직접 만든 경기 규칙. 하나, 경주로는 교실 앞문에서 뒷문까지. 둘, 단칙 시 3초 정지 페널티 적용. Alright, so, are you ready? Yes. Okay. Oh, good stuffing. Off you go. First thing. Oh, we're going that way, are we? Okay. Alright. Are you ready? Five, four, three, two. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes,
마지막 3라운드 물고기 선수들을 소개합니다. 드디어 시작되는 파이널 빅매치. 과연 어떤 물고기가 챔피언의 영광을 차지하게 될까요? Now, I just want to have a look before we do have our final race for them to explain the theory behind their design. Well, we never really know what to do, so we just put it Why did, why did you want to put a flip on the end? What were you hoping it would do? Because then if you push it, then the wind would push it.열띤 마지막 수업이 끝나고 점점 이별의 순간이 다가오는데요. Okay, so as you all know, we've had um, Ming Kyung here with us. She's done some pretty cool things. We're really lucky. Something else very cool in New Zealand before you. Thank you. So that's our, our little kiwi, that's our native bird. You know, we certificate for you. From Horswell School, thank you for being at our school.
너무 빨리 찾아온 이별의 시간. 아이들은 이메일을 교환하며 다음을 약속하는데요. 꼭 맞잡은 두 손처럼 서로의 마음을 나눈 일주일의 시간. 아이들은 그 무엇보다 값진 친구 그리고 우정을 선물 받았습니다. 저 친구 울고 있다, 비니 때문에. 
And finally, this is for you. So all 12 of them signed it. So you remember, you remember us, okay? Is this for me? Thank you, thank you very much. That's so pretty. You drew this? Wow, cute, yeah? Okay, I'm gonna read this to everyone, have a seat. It says, I'm gonna, Cry. To Forby and friends, hi, it's me, Jun. I'm writing this letter to thank to you, to my teacher and friends. First, thank you for being normal and helping, normal, I don't know if you're normal. <laughs> and helping me to adapt quickly. Jackson, this is Jun. Are you Jun? Good morning, Jun. Yes, welcome. I'm your body. Thank you for helping me to adapt on this school. If I can, I will send email too. Bye. From Jun. Thank you, Jun. Thank you. Thank you. I miss you, Jun. Goodbye, Jun. <laughs> email, please. Juni, we're going to miss you. Um, please keep in touch with us, if you can. I know that you have a super bright future. You, you're going to go far in this world.